Okay, so this plug here, this goes to a power outlet that has six outlets or something, and I had a bunch of stuff plugged in. Um, everything shut off, and I didn't know why, and I had partly power. Well, when I tested this plug, I had 94 volts. Well, I pulled this out, didn't look bad, and... I tested the plug that way of it that's tied to here and it's 94 volts. I tested the plugs that way and they were 94, 94 and then I had one more plug that was 120. So I pulled that plug out thinking maybe something came loose. I pulled every plug out coming down the line and isolated them from everything this way and I started getting 120 once I started isolating everything this way. Well, I should have started at this plug, which I thought I did, but this plug has the line coming in and then the line going out to that plug that way. I should have unplugged, undone it, which I did, but then I should have took my meter and tested the line voltage this way and I would have had 120. As soon as I plug it into this thing, it drops to 94 volts. So whatever happened to this plug, somehow, I, I don't know, it don't look bad. It's given me resistance down to 94 volts, which is not letting any of my electronics work. I ended up changing that plug and I'm good. So if you ever have this problem, pull this out undo both blacks and put a meter on them the line coming in and see where you're at if you're 94 volts coming in go that way you know wherever it's coming from if it's 120 then you know something's wrong here if it's 120 then you can wire nut the two wires together and isolate this out of the way and test the plug down there and if that's 120, which it was, Bob's your uncle.